At CES 2020, ASUS introduces new Wi-Fi 6 mesh system under the Zen Wi-Fi lineup. According to ASUS, Zen Wi-Fi AX XT8 Wi-Fi 6 mesh delivers unparalleled performance and coverage, and it cost $450 at the time of this review. So please sit back, relax, and enjoy the review, and see if ASUS Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system is a good solution for you. First, let's do a quick unboxing. The Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system comes with two ASUS AX6600 Wi-Fi 6 routers, power adapters, an Ethernet cable, and a quick start guide. Now let's look at the specs. The mesh system is powered by a quad-core CPU running at 1.5 GHz. It supports AX6600 tri-band Wi-Fi 6 802.11 AX mesh standard, OFDMA, beam forming, mu mo and does not support WPA3 and weighs only 716 grams. The each router has 6 internal antennas, with 2.5 GB WAN ports for internet and 3 1 GB LAN ports and USB 3 Gen 1 ports. Let's talk about the design and features. The Zen Wi-Fi 6 AX system pulls aesthetic inspiration from high-end ZenBook notebook lineup, but the overall body dimensions are small, measuring 6.3 inch by 3 inch by 6.4 inch. The new design has a lot of ventilations on the top and bottom to keep the powerful hardware temperature under control. The Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system includes two Wi-Fi 6 routers in a mesh Wi-Fi configuration for maximum performance and coverage up to 5,500 square feet. According to ASUS, it achieves unparalleled throughput with Wi-Fi 6 support for both clients and internode communications, up to 6600 megabits per second, across one 2.4 GHz band and two 5 GHz bands, yielding up to twice or more aggregate speed than a Wi-Fi 5 capable tri-band router. That's perfect for many modern homes, even on the larger side of things. So this Wi-Fi system is looking great for families, small offices, or apartments. So it's a great system for multi-story houses. The ASUS Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh unit using OFDMA features of Wi-Fi 6. The Wi-Fi traffic is managed more efficiently since data is transmitted from different devices at the same time, rather than having each device data wait for its turn. This results in efficient use of airtime, reduced latency, and increased bandwidth to add more devices to your network. With MU-MIMO, multiple users can access the router simultaneously without any decrease in bandwidth which means you can connect more devices than ever before. It increased Wi-Fi data rates up to 60% to enjoy lag-free online gaming and even 8K streaming. The Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system delivers three individual Wi-Fi bands, two 5 GHz bands and one 2.4 GHz band. You have option to combining them under a single network name or keeping them separate with names for each band. You also have the option to dedicate one of the 5 GHz band for backhaul support. A backhaul connection is a network connection between the routers themselves, and it is not something your mobile devices can see or utilize. If you choose not to set one up, your mobile devices can use all three bands for network and internet access, but the routers will communicate on one of the 5 GHz bands. If you select to have a backhaul connection, the router and device traffic are separated, reducing possible network congestion. This system also supports a wired backhaul solution. You can utilize one of the Ethernet ports on each router to connect your existing network for wired backhaul connection. This gives the routers a dedicated connection while giving your mobile devices access to all three wireless bands. ASUS designed the Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system setup to be very easy. It's a three-step process. All you have to do is download ASUS router app to your Android or iOS device. Connect one of the two ASUS routers to your modem or if you have a Fios, you can connect directly to your Ethernet cable. Then just follow the instructions in the app to complete the setup or you can set up using your web browser. The web browser setup has a very clean interface. You have a lot of options to configure the system. So we are going to go over the settings very quickly to see what are the available options. On the main screen, we have router information, internet information, wireless settings with Wi-Fi mesh information, number of connected devices, and also router CPU and memory utilization information. Then you have AI mesh information, guest network, AI protection, QoS, traffic analyzer, USB application, AI cloud. Then under advanced settings, we have wireless information, LAN information, DHCP server, then we have WAN information. The Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system supports Alexa and IFTTT compatible smart home devices, allows you to use voice commands to start a guest network, pause the internet, and more. Further down the list, we have IPv6 settings, VPN settings, firewall configuration, administration settings, system logs, and network tools. But you don't have to set up all these settings if you're not a power user. 
you can leave everything to default or you can use asus router app to complete the whole process quite fast and to be honest i use asus router app to set up mesh network and we highly recommend it to use app to complete the setup now let's do some performance coverage and speed test so we place the asus zen wi-fi 6 router in the basement storage room it has concrete walls around it and it is in the lowest part of the house we also place the second zen wi-fi 6 router on the second floor of the house and configure the wi-fi 6 mesh network also we're going to use iphone xs max and intel's ax200 wi-fi 6 network card for this test so the total square footage of the house is 5000 square feet i will be testing wi-fi connection in different corners of the house and floors to see how well asus zen wi-fi 6 mesh system performs in terms of speed and coverage we will also perform wi-fi 6 backhaul performance test by transferring 6 gb file over wi-fi 6 backhaul so let's get started Okay, so here as you can see on the phone screen, we have ASUS Zen Wi-Fi 6 name ASUS Wi-Fi 6. And for reference name, Batman, Superman and Wonder Woman are Wi-Fi bands from ASUS GT AC5300 tri-band router to create Wi-Fi interference to see how well ASUS Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh will perform in close neighborhood Wi-Fi interference locations. I have 100 by 100 megabits per second Verizon Fios connection. And standing right next to the Wi-Fi router, I'm getting full 100% connection speed which is great, confirming the Wi-Fi router is working properly. Now for the second test, I'm standing 30 feet away from the router in the basement with a couple of walls between the Wi-Fi router and the phone. I have so far good Wi-Fi connection with still 100% Wi-Fi speed. Now let's move from the basement to the main floor of the house and do a third Wi-Fi speed and connection test. Now I am standing right next to second Zen Wi-Fi 6 router on the second floor of the house and Wi-Fi connection is still strong with again full 100% Wi-Fi connection speed. Now I moved to the far left side of the house and close to 60 feet from the Wi-Fi router with the floor and few walls in between router and phone and 30 feet from the second Wi-Fi 6 router on the main floor with few walls in between the satellite and the phone. Here we still have good Wi-Fi signals with again full 100% Wi-Fi speed. Now let's move to the far right side of the house and close to 30 feet from the Wi-Fi 6 router with the floor and few walls and close to 60 feet from the second Wi-Fi 6 router with few walls in between the second router and the phone. Here again we still have good Wi-Fi signals with full 100% Wi-Fi speed. Now let's move to the second floor of the house. Here we have two floors and few walls between the main router and one floor and few walls between the second Wi-Fi router and the phone. Here we still have 100% Wi-Fi signal strength with 100% Wi-Fi speed. Now we are going to do a Wi-Fi 6 backhaul speed test. In this test we have our local NAS device connected to Zen Wi-Fi 6 router via Ethernet and our desktop is connected to second Wi-Fi 6 router via Ethernet as well. In this test we are going to transfer 6 GB of file over Wi-Fi 6 backhaul connection. So as you can see we are getting close to 95 megabytes per second transfer speed which is the best Wi-Fi 6 backhaul speed as compared to our previous reviews. And just to remind everyone, the NICs on router, satellite and desktops are 1 gig NICs. So that is a limiting factor here. 95 megabytes per second means saturating full 1 gig NIC speed. Now we are going to do a wireless Wi-Fi 6 file transfer speed test. In this test we have Intel's AX200 Wi-Fi 6 network card. Are we going to transfer the same close to 6 GB file over Wi-Fi and see how it performs. So as you can see we are getting close to 75 megabytes per second transfer speed, which is also very good. As mentioned before, ASUS Zen Wi-Fi 6 supports a wired backhaul solution. This gives the router a dedicated connection, while give your mobile devices access to all three wireless bands, and you can set up 160MHz wide 5GHz channel with speed up to 572MBps per second. So if you're using mesh setup, you cannot utilize 160MHz, so something to keep in mind. Overall, the ASUS Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system provides 4 times the network capacity of Wi-Fi 5. It is powered by quad-core CPU running at 1.5 GHz, supports AX6600 Wi-Fi 6 802.11ax mesh system. Also Wi-Fi 6 or 802.11ax is more energy efficient and doesn't drain the battery life of your mobile devices nearly as much as Wi-Fi 5 or 802.11ac does. Overall, ASUS Zen Wi-Fi 6 XT8 AX6600 Wi-Fi 6 mesh system did perform well in this review. The Wi-Fi 6 mesh system delivers good coverage and will not have problem covering 5500 square feet as advertised and each unit can cover up to 2800 square feet. So the final question is, 
should you buy Asus Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system? My answer is, if you have Wi-Fi 6 devices and want future-proof Wi-Fi 6 mesh system and require to cover 5,000 square feet and willing to spend $450, then Asus Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system is a good solution for you. Let me know what you guys think of Asus Zen Wi-Fi 6 mesh system in the comments below. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon for notifications for future videos. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.